This week, we're visiting a corner of the Transformers universe the Basics hasn't explored very often. The Japanese side of the world of Beast Wars, as we profile Maximal Commander Lyo Convoy. Released in 1998, the original Lyo Convoy toy was created for the Japanese version of the Beast Wars toy line. Like his name suggests, he transformed into a white lion, loaded with weapons and gimmicks like his spinning Lion Typhoon mane. Both a firm military commander and a kind and honest bot devoted to justice and good, Lyo Convoy was the first of many Japanese original characters to carry the Convoy rank, a title shared by commanders in the Maximal Army who all resembled Optimus Prime and who each carried a power source known as an Energon Matrix. Lyo Convoy was the leader of the Maximal unit featured in the Japanese exclusive animated series Beast Wars Second. The series was set tens of thousands of years in the future, and began with Lyo Convoy being lured into a trap in an asteroid belt by Predacon Emperor Galvatron. Caught in an explosion, Lyo Convoy was hurled across space to the planet Gaia, which was secretly actually post-apocalyptic Earth. There, his damaged body was found by a white lion, which brought him to a cave brimming with Angle-moi energy, a mysterious power that dwelled within the planet. Healed by the energy, Lyo Convoy scanned the lion to serve as his beast mode, then reunited with his troops for a new mission to prevent Galvatron from acquiring the power of Gaia's Angle-moi energy for himself. Later in the series, Lyo Convoy was shocked to discover that the interaction of the Angle Moi energy with his Energon Matrix during his recovery had caused the spontaneous creation of a childlike duplicate of him named Lyo Jr. A rash, temperamental kid with an Energon Matrix of his own, Lyo Jr. considered Lyo Convoy his father, but Convoy refused to acknowledge Jr. as anything but a soldier. Multiple colour variations of Lyo Convoy's toy were offered as store exclusives and contest prizes, including a black version, which doubled as the evil clone Copy Convoy featured in one episode of the cartoon, one sharing Galvatron's purple colour scheme, representing Lyo when Galvatron temporarily corrupted him with evil-tainted Anglemoi in the Beast Wars second manga, and a sparkling translucent version named Flash Lyo Convoy, a powered up form Lyo Convoy took on in the Beast Wars second movie, in which he teamed up with the time travelling Optimus Primal and the pair united the power of their Energon matrices to defeat the monstrous Majin Zarak. At the climax of the cartoon, when Galvatron summoned his ultimate weapon, the artificial planet Nemesis, to drain Gaia's Anglemoi, Lyo Convoy and Lyo Jr. faced the Predacon leader in final battle together. Finally accepting the brave youngster as his son, Lyo Convoy's Energon Matrix fused with Jr.'s, merging the two Maximals into a mighty green lion. With their enhanced powers, they dispersed the Anglemoi energy across the galaxy and destroyed Galvatron and the Nemesis, causing a massive explosion that tore open a wormhole in space and time, into which they vanished. Audiences wouldn't learn what had become of Lyo Convoy until near the end of the 1999 sequel series Beast Wars Neo, which revealed that the wormhole had flung him back in time. Thousands of years in the past, he discovered that Angle Moi Energy was, in fact, the disembodied life force of the monster planet Unicron. With Unicron now free from his prison within Gaia, Lyo Convoy returned to join forces with Big Convoy and prevent the Dark God's spirit from taking Cybertron as his new body. Lyo Convoy was unquestionably the most popular breakout new character created for the Japanese Beast Era series, and that popularity has seen him appear in multiple new series and receive many new toys in the 21st century, both in his native Japan and from Hasbro in America, who even made his original toy available in their markets through their web store in the year 2000. 
Lyo Convoy's appearances in new Japanese series have tended to be set within the continuity of the Beast Wars cartoons, beginning with 2004's Robot Masters, which saw him sent back in time from Gaia to 21st century Earth, where he teamed up with other Maximal and Autobot leaders. His story was continued after the events of Beast Wars Neo by, of all things, the Japanese version of the Transformers Prime toy line in 2012, which included an exclusive new toy recolored from Prime Thundertron. The profile that came with this figure detailed how Lyo Convoy had joined the Council of Convoys that governed Cybertron, and crossed dimensions into the world of Transformers Prime to investigate the awakening of Unicron in that universe. His dimension-hopping adventures continued into the Transformers Legends toyline in 2017, in which he travelled into the Legends world and merged with his counterpart from that universe to become a Headmaster, a tiny robot forming the head of a larger body, retooled from the 2016 Titans Return Alpha Trion figure, which transformed into both a lion and a spaceship. Meanwhile, in Hasbro markets, Lyo Convoy appeared in IDW Publishing's Beast Wars comic book miniseries between 2006 and 2008, an alternate continuation of the cartoon's story in which he led a maximal unit called The Pack in stopping the Predacon Shocker Act's Anglemois fueled ambitions. And several toys of him were released in the Transformers Classics and Universe lines between 2007 and 2009, all of which were recolored of the Autobot Lion, Leo Breaker. These figures were sold under the more US market friendly name, Leo Prime, and that name would even make it back over to Japan, where it was used for the Transformers Prime and Legends toys, presented as an alias Lyo Convoy had adopted while visiting the Prime Universe. In 2015, the Transformers Collectors Club offered an exclusive figure of Lyo Convoy that reimagined him with a Cybertronian truck mode, retooled from the Transformers Generations Orion Pax toy. This figure led to Lyo Convoy receiving his biggest role in English language media yet, in the club's Beast Wars Uprising series of stories between 2015 and 2016. This series was set on a dystopian, alternate future Cybertron, where the Maximals and Predacons were an impoverished underclass made to fight in gladiatorial blood sports by their Autobot and Decepticon masters. The Lyo Convoy of this world worked under Eject, the overseer of these games, to manipulate their outcomes, until a chance encounter with the revolutionary Black Arachnia opened his eyes to the injustices of his world, and he joined her in leading an uprising against their cruel masters. To counter the rebellious Lyo Convoy, Eject created the dark clone Galva Convoy, based on the original Galvatron-coloured Lyo Convoy figure, and released as an exclusive toy at official convention BotCon in 2016. Corrupted by alien artificial intelligence Lord Imperius Delirious, Galva Convoy turned on his creator and began his own twisted effort to bring a form of peace to the planet with a virus that reformatted Transformers into mindless Viacon drones. But Lyo Convoy was able to defeat him by infecting him with the very virus he had created. Most recently, a new toy of Lyo Convoy was released in the high-end collector-targeted Masterpiece line in 2020, based directly on the stylized proportions and cartoonish features of his anime character design. And another is coming in 2022 from Flame Toys line of stylized anime-inspired model kits, continued proof of the character's ongoing popularity as the pride of the Japanese Beast Wars line. And those are the basics on Lyo Convoy. For more Transformers history and lore from around the world, be sure to like, subscribe and click the bell to be notified about future episodes, or get early access to them by subscribing on Patreon.